all you need to know. I got the keys, okay? I got them. Now let's go to the freaking pool. Are you kidding? This is awesome. again oh okay maybe i can start out of the house maybe i can start out of the house okay good Are you kidding? He beat me to it. Mm. I didn't say so. Okay. block a lot and it just doesn't want to do it it's done it's a thing it's a real legit evil thing also thank you for the health because i needed it can i go now please jeez Out of here. Also, this is a tiger. Oh. <laughs> that no. Are you kidding? Yeah. I want to be frank and frank with the tiger. Are you kidding? I didn't even have to think about that. But, uh, let me go. Oh. Okay. Shoot, where do you want me to go now? There's the... I don't know. I don't remember if it's this way or the other way. Don't eat the tiger, go! Tony, go. Thank you. Are you kidding? I got Tony the Tiger with me. Who needs anything? Concentrating now. 
<laughs> I'm not talking very much. And I need to be. Because I'm running a show. Just, you know. When fighting is not that easy. We got the keys. See? Nice job. <sighs> and now open these doors so we can start shopping. Squee! No. But. Kyoko. Oh. <laughs> just a few stores. Remember, Ricky? <sighs> Okay, let's go find that spooky Amada guy. Go buy it. For me. You just need to die. Okay. It's okay. We're okay. Everything's fine. Dang it! 
Oh my. You're annoying. So much hassle. You think I'm gonna do? Be friends? No. No, no, no. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Space Girls again. comic book thingy? Uh, Cosmic Mega Babes? Yeah, but they only had the standard edition cover. Ugh. I oh, could barely oh, bring myself to read it three really times. <laughs> we can't find he Yamada. Anywhere else he might be? He also hangs around the construction site. But if you go there, be careful. Why? Because it's a construction site. Oh, yeah. Anyway, thanks and stuff. Anytime! I mean, like... Literally any time. My life is pretty boring. I get that. I really do. Alright. <laughs> Are you joking? Go. Get out of here. 
Thank you. Oh, sweet. I got help. Okay. I got tattooed and uh, 20. Land a hit, please. Please just let me. Okay. Thank you. Construction site? It's so lucky. Yo, Magic Boy! You up there? My name's not Magic Boy! He's up there. Come on, let's go beat some info out of him. Try to follow. Cool. 
Or do you want me to go? Because it's obviously not here. Go to the one spot. That's new. Okay. I'm just gonna wait. Okay. I hate. I hate that. Oh. Yamada. Yamada. Ladies, welcome to my lair. This is a rooftop. This is a naked. Yeah, not even a finished one. It, rooftops can be lairs. Whatever. We're looking for Kunio and Ricky. That big girl said you hang out with them. Do ya? <laughs> As if. Those guys are losers. What did he say about my Ricky poo? Chill, Kyoko. I'll chill this guy's face! Relax. I haven't talked to him in years. I thought you guys he were is. friends. We were. A long time ago. He is a voice actor. What's happening? So what's that like? Uh, it's a flashback. No one cares, Yamada. We were just kids then. Oh. I was ten years old when my family moved to River City. I hated Damn. them for moving. I hated having to leave my friends behind. I hated lots of things. I hate you guys. Is this gonna take long? I was sure I'd never make another friend. Well. But as we unpacked, this boy across the street said hello. His name was Cunio, and he seemed nice. He is nice. Now where is he? Is Ricky in the story? Cunio and I became best friends. We read comics together, watched TV, played intergalactic space rangers. Life was good. Aw, see, that's sweet. Only because Cunio's in it. Then one day, a girl transferred to our school. Her name was Hasabe, and she was an angel. It was the first and last time I ever fell in love. Hasabe, oh, I can't stand her. Yeah, she's sort of the worst. I went <laughs> to the park after school that day. Hey. Excited to tell my best friend Kunio about the girl I would soon marry. Wait, aren't you like 10? Yeah, that's pretty weird, dude. But when I got to the park, Kunio was already there. And so was Hasabe. Oh, dang, that's hecka sad. Or Kunio, maybe. That trash girl never deserved him. That night, I decided I would get my revenge on Kunio, on Hasabe, on everyone. I turned to the dark arts to become stronger. That's creepy. That. I don't like scary things. Wrap it up, Merlin. Then later, <laughs> middle school. Okay, we get it. Jeez. So, at ten I years old, the love of my life to do the and my arts. best friend in the same day. But thanks to the dark arts, I would never again be. Okay, wait up. Love of your life? You barely met the girl. Did he even meet her? Wait, yeah, did you even meet her? Love needs no introduction. That's not how love works. Uh, Listen, freak show. I don't care that about your childhood, not just like, hello? your crush on trash queens, <laughs> or any fakey magic tricks you okay. learned. We're looking for Kunio. And Ricky. Well. And Ricky. 
to either tell us who took them or stop wasting our time. <laughs> you girls are all the same. Okay. We look nothing alike. Always insulting me, always treating me like dirt. You look like dirt. You know, part of why I learned the dark arts was to meet girls. <laughs> Looks like that's about to pay off. Ew. Yeah. You can swear. All right. It's so next about to get dark. We uh, fight your mother. I'm going to bed. Peace.